This video will go over lecture design for using a tablet in the classroom. Starting with the preparation, we're going to use PowerPoint to start off our lecture slides. We're just going to add text and figures here. Here we're going to save it as a PDF. This will allow us to use other programs to write in it using the tablet. For this next part, we have the actual presentation. So now we're going to take those slides we've made and we're going to write on them using the PDF notes in class. So once we come to this part of the lecture with the example problem, we'll go ahead and write through and work out the problem. This is just an example shown for this video. It will not be completed. gray portion below you see moved up is the hand rest. It allows you to write on the tablet um, or rest your hand on the tablet without writing on it. Here we're saving the Dropbox. You can use other means to save your information. This is so footage of it actually being used in class. This is Dr. Leeper's Mechanics and Materials course in Missouri S&T. You're able to freely walk around the classroom and interact with students face to face. You no longer have to look at the board while writing notes. The last part is post-processing. So after we've had our notes saved for a lecture class, we're going to go ahead and modify what we've got. This portion we're going to use Adobe Acrobat Pro to modify the lecture slides. You can see here we're still able to modify the written text. And in this case, we want to replace that written text with type text. Just for the sake of clarity.
We're going to save the changes as an image file. This allows for easy sharing across pretty much any format. Thank you for watching.